Did you kill it? I don't know. But I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? We 
need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to Man, I ain't never getting home to mom at this rate. This sucks. Come on, let's talk this night. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! No need us! We're not gonna hurt you. I thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chunk. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as narrow as this neighborhood since downtown is miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. <laughs> we shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safe in there. I'm not her dad. Oh. Her babysitter. Her parents <laughs> are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... The monster's coming. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. As babysitters go, I'd say her parents owe you a tip. Sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. And quiet as usual the past couple of days. We're wrecking down the way things of mares down the lane, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Jack. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boys are life-saving. Glad he could be a help to somebody. 
so yeah, it's just you and your daughter then? <laughs> oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know who this man is? Yes. Okay then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yeah, it's not doing so good. Might be helping you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? I didn't. Well, now's the time. <laughs> it's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed? Before the car accident. Home. Where's home? I grew up in Macon. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? Nobody. Is that so? Yes. It is. You said we. That's all. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there. We're done here. I didn't get your name, darling. Um, Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we find our parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit in the fence. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. <laughs> well, I'm all done here. They should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If the leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? They'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be perfect. <laughs> There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. Right there. It smells like I know what it smells like. <laughs> Duty. I miss my mom and dad. I bet. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. I love you, baby. <laughs>